caught on camera people not distancing themselves inside essential businesses around Jacksonville. Yeah, take a look at some video from a small Lakewood grocery store and restaurant. People standing close as they waited in a checkout line. And News for Jack spotting similar scenes at other stores and even this laundromat with dozens of people inside. Reporter Eric Avignet visited a number of businesses to see which ones have been complying with the recommendations. While stores in Jacksonville are considered essential businesses that need to remain open during this global pandemic, the CDC recommendation to distance ourselves is still in place. While customers in some stores are practicing those recommendations, we found customers that were not. While Allison Harden and her husband were buying a TV at this Walmart, Allison became concerned as she got closer to the checkout lanes. I see people not doing what we've been asked to do. Common sense. Stay my distance away from people. At this Pepe's grocery store and restaurant, plexiglass separates cashiers from customers, and employees are doing their best to keep the grocery cart sanitized. I spray everything down. Seats. But despite those precautions and this sign asking customers to stay behind the yellow line at checkout and keep an arm's distance apart, we still see what appears to be a crowd inside the small store and lines of people close to each other. The owners didn't want to comment on camera, but say they're doing their best to encourage people to keep a distance from each other. Our crime and safety expert Ken Jefferson reviewed the video and says shock is not the word he would use to describe what he saw. It's something that can be preventable. It's something that can help flatten the curve. Uh, and, and people are ignoring it, so that just angers me. Just around the corner at this laundromat, I counted 55 people inside at one time, and many of those people were bunched close to each other. The owner didn't want to talk on camera because she says she was confused by what's acceptable per the mayor and the governor, but the CEO of the Coin Laundry Association released this video explaining his recommendations to keep laundromats on the essential list. To avoid uh, overcrowding in your store and try to uh, maintain the social distancing and the guidance around uh, you know, groups of 10 or more people gathering at any one given time. Eric Avigny, Channel 4, the local station. And hours after News for Jack spoke with the owner, we went back in and found out that she had removed tables and separated chairs from each other. She said that she and her husband were putting up signs to warn people about the changes. She also plans to encourage customers to either drop off their clothing or load the machines and then go back to their cars and wait for the clothes to be washed and dried.